Welcome to the Listen for Life podcast with Genevieve Richardson. Genevieve is a speech language pathologist rehabilitating adults with communication challenges after a stroke or due to a neurological impairment. Living with aphasia is hard. Caregiving is hard. You are not alone. Get equipped with knowledge from experts in the field and professionals you need to know. We'll hear stories and experiences from others who are navigating life with aphasia. So, Put your earphones in and take a walk outside. This isn't just a podcast. This is a community, a resource, and a support system. We're in this together. Do life. Hi there. I'm Genevieve Richardson, Life Speech Pathology, Life Aphasia Academy. Helping people takes a village. This is my why. These are my girls, 17 and 15. I would want someone to do for my family what I am doing to help theirs. We believe in whole person, whole family recovery. Aphasia impacts speaking, listening, reading, writing, and thinking. Someone could have trouble talking, getting their words out of their mouth. They may have trouble with the muscles of their mouth and coordinating. They could have trouble understanding the simplest of phrases. What would you like for dinner? Do you want to go to sleep? Shall we go out to dinner? They may not be able to read their emails or text messages. Well, it's a meander place and it has to, two of them, for dreaming and pending after supper and up and down, four of down and three of up. Think about a time when you were so tired or perhaps sick and you just couldn't pull your thoughts together to say something to your wife. What if she interrupted you by trying to be helpful Uh, trying to help you find your words, and you just lost your train of thought. What if this feeling, this frustration impacted you every day? Could you go back to work if this is how you spoke? Would your friends react to you talking to them at a barbecue? And what if you couldn't tell jokes like you used to? Would your boss let you come back to work? Could you do your job? Aphasia, it impacts all ages. It can take away your dreams, your career. It can ruin your self-confidence. It can rob you of friends and family and relationships. It's isolating and lonely, but it doesn't have to be that way. So my company, we serve survivors who have gone through a stroke and they have residual effects impacting their speech, their language, their thinking. We also are about building community. Life Aphasia Academy is about supporting spouses and families and partners and loved ones of survivors of stroke, as well as other conditions. Neurologic conditions can impact your ability to communicate whether it's Parkinson's disease, primary progressive aphasia, a traumatic brain injury, or other condition. Action plus intention equals manifestation. That's why I'm here today recording this video trying to convey what life is all about. It's about building community. I am actively building courses for spouses soon to be released. I want spouses to be able to communicate more effectively with their loved ones. I want their loved ones to be back in the community doing the things that they wanna do. I'm working to mentor grad students. I've had the honor of working with some students at the University of Texas Health System down in San Antonio, the Department of Communication Sciences and Disorders. I started a podcast, woohoo! Listen for life, soon to be released. 
The trailer is up now on Spotify and Apple Podcasts and wherever you listen to your podcasts, soon to be released. But I have a challenge. I am not waiting around. Every day, not only am I treating clients, talking to their spouses, building programs, I am connecting with members of my community. I'm reaching out to professionals through uh, mutual connections here in my community. I'm talking to my spouses and their families and getting connected with the people in their community. But I need help. I cannot do this alone. How can you help? First, this is not an eating challenge, and it's definitely not getting in shape challenge. But I need to know who you know. I need to know what you need to know. I have a pretty good idea of what spouses and survivors need to know to live their best life, whether it's getting therapy, getting hooked up with the right professionals, making connections in their community. I want to thank you for your time. Thank you for sitting through my video. This is a QR code with contact information for the business. If you'd like, grab your QR reader and snap a picture. Otherwise, it'll be on my website. Thank you so much for listening. Have a fabulous day. Thanks for tuning in to the Listen for Life podcast. We hope you feel empowered and supported. Head over to listenforlifepodcast.com to see the show notes with links and information from today's episode. Do you have a topic, a resource to share, or a guest recommendation? Inquiring minds want to know. Let us know in the comments section. Wishing you a fabulous week.